Tesla has unveiled the much-anticipated Highland redesign of their Model 3 sedan. In this overview, we'll delve into the innovative features, address the circulating rumours, and explore what this means for Tesla's trajectory. The Model 3 Highland has made its grand debut. After months filled with speculation, sneak peeks and buzz, Tesla showcased the revamped design of their renowned four-door sedan on August 31st. This grand reveal took place in Norway, coinciding with Tesla's 10-year anniversary celebration. Julian Bailo, Tesla's lead design visionary, was present to introduce the car to an eager audience of global journalists and enthusiasts. The Highland Refresh stands out, even amidst the anticipation surrounding Tesla's upcoming Cybertruck. This redesign introduces a plethora of enhancements, most notably a transformative exterior design language. This not only bestows the car with a modern, sleek appearance, but also enhances its aerodynamics, potentially boosting its range. Insights from Tesla's announcement and first-hand accounts from the Norway event provide a comprehensive understanding of these updates. Let's dive into the details. One of the primary enhancements is the updated suspension paired with a more rigid body. This rigidity is attributed to Tesla's initiative to reduce the number of components in the vehicle's construction. This objective, highlighted during their Investor Day event on March 1st, has evidently been achieved. The exterior has undergone a significant transformation. The sharper panelling not only gives the car a modern aesthetic, but also improves aerodynamics. This design reportedly diminishes interior noise from prior models, contributing to an estimated 12% increase in range. The car's refreshed look is complemented by two new paint options, Ultra Red and Stealth Grey. Additionally, the Model 3 now sports 18-inch photon rims, with an alternative 19-inch Nova wheels available in select regions. Another notable update is the tyre composition, optimised for the Highland Model 3. While it slightly reduces the top speed, it enhances the overall driving comfort. However, it's the interior where Tesla's redesign truly shines. The company had emphasized its focus on the interior and its evident why. Subtle LED strips have been introduced along the dashboard, center console, and doors with customizable settings for users. The infotainment screen is more prominent and user-centric, now housing the gear selector reminiscent of the Model S design. For contingencies, a manual gear option is strategically placed above the driver. The steering wheel has been revamped, integrating functions like turn signals and wiper controls through capacitive touch buttons, essentially transforming it into a tactile interface. The technological advancements aren't limited to the dashboard. The Model 3 now boasts enhanced Bluetooth and Wi-Fi capabilities. The sound system has been upgraded to include 17 speakers, a leap from the previous 14. The seating experience has been elevated with ventilated front seats and more plush rear seats, crafted with a new perforated material. Rear passengers are also treated to an 8-inch infotainment screen nestled between the front seats, ensuring entertainment and control are within arm's reach. While many might find it surprising that Tesla chose not to debut the Highland in the US, given the company's significant focus on the region, there's a rationale behind it. Tesla has grappled with aligning Model 3 to the stringent requirements of the new Inflation Reduction Act's rebate system. As a result, the refreshed Model 3 won't grace the US until regulatory nuances are ironed out. In the meantime, countries like China, the UAE, Israel, Australia, New Zealand and most of Europe, barring the UK, are already enjoying the revamped design. We remain hopeful for its prompt introduction in North America. As with any Tesla initiative, the rumour mill was in overdrive leading up to the Highlands unveiling. The interior enhancements like ambient lighting, perforated and ventilated seats, and the shift from traditional toggles to steering wheel and infotainment display buttons were spot on. While there's still debate on user reception to these changes, one thing seems certain. The speculated upgrade to FSD Hardware 4. Promotional materials and order pages hint at HWD4 cameras, including one on the front bumper, lending credence to this rumour. 
However, the chatter about high-definition radar units remains unconfirmed, likely awaiting a detailed Monroe Live teardown analysis. But Tesla's FCC filings from December did indicate plans for such an inclusion, presumably in the HWD 450. Another point of contention is the battery composition. Elon Musk hinted at an iron manganese phosphate composition, but concrete evidence remains elusive. The Highland's extended range could be attributed to its aerodynamic design or enhanced mechanics, but it doesn't clarify its absence in the US market. The Inflation Reduction Act mandates that eligible vehicles for rebates must have at least 50% of their battery manufactured in the US. If Highland's battery is a product of CATL, a Chinese firm, Tesla would be hesitant to introduce it in the US to preserve their rebate eligibility. While not definitive, it's evident that there's more beneath the surface. Lastly, there was a buzz about Model 3 incorporating a steer-by-wire system, a technology that connects the steering mechanism without a physical link. While the allure of new car features is undeniably captivating, it's the broader implications for Tesla's trajectory that truly pique our interest. The Cybertruck, with its avant-garde tech, might seem like the future, but the Model 3 offers a clearer window into Tesla's long-term vision. The Cybertruck, in all its uniqueness, was intentionally designed as an outlier. Tesla could have ventured into the pickup market long ago if that was the sole intent. Instead, they aimed for a product that would turn heads, making the Cybertruck's role in Tesla's future somewhat ambiguous. In contrast, the Model 3 stands as a cornerstone of Tesla's lineup and a top seller. Its significant updates signal broader shifts within the company, a sentiment echoed by Tesla during their March Investor Day event. The Model 3 Highland's revamped design and manufacturing approach are particularly telling. Notable is the transition from traditional control sticks to a yoke-like steering wheel equipped with haptic touchscreen buttons. While innovative, such a change carries inherent risks, necessitating iterative refinements based on user feedback. It also suggests Tesla might be cautious about introducing this feature in other models until its reception is well assessed. Diving deeper into the Highland's transformative elements, Tesla's design evolution becomes evident. Historically, Tesla vehicles, barring the Cybertruck, have been characterized by their soft, rounded light fixtures and fluid body curves. The Highland, however, introduces a more defined, edgy aesthetic, evident in its sharper lines and compact light design. This refreshed look not only modernizes the Model 3, but also hints at a potential design overhaul for Tesla's entire range. The interior mirrors this shift, adopting a crisper design that accentuates the expansive infotainment screen. These changes, while subtle, rejuvenate Tesla's signature style while optimizing production costs. Moreover, the Model 3's production methodology has undergone a paradigm shift. Previously, its assembly was intricate, involving numerous components pieced together meticulously. However, Tesla's recent Investor Day revelations indicate a drive towards simplification. Drawing insights from their GigaPress experiences with the Model Y and Cybertruck, Tesla's approach leans towards minimizing componentry. This not only streamlines production, but also underscores Tesla's renewed focus, enhancing assembly efficiency to optimize costs and boost production rates. Clear indicators suggest that Tesla's recent innovations will shape its future endeavors. Following the buzz around Project Highland, details about Project Juniper, a redesign of the Model Y, began to emerge. In a conversation with Tesla's chief designer, Franz von Holzhausen, it was revealed that there's active development on the Model S. Moreover, Tesla unveiled a teaser for a new, yet-to-be-named model during their Investor Day event. This upcoming vehicle promises not only to be more cost-effective than the Model 3, but also serves as a testament to Tesla's ambitions. The company plans to leverage its new Mexican facility to experiment with the production enhancements introduced in Project Highland, essentially using this new model as a testing ground. The forthcoming years promise transformative growth for Tesla. As they gear up to harness the potential of their latest technological advancements, the anticipation is palpable.
if Tesla successfully navigates these changes, we can expect a rejuvenated vehicle lineup, the introduction of fresh models, and state-of-the-art automated production processes. Indeed, Project Highland seems to be just the tip of the iceberg for Tesla's innovation journey.